it'll all be ready tomorrow night, they promise. But today it was hard to picture limousines in place of front loaders. And elegant people who paid up to $200 a ticket sipping champagne at this refreshment promenade. On stage, the 75-member company is getting ready, too, for the $100,000 opening night charity benefit performance. I asked Donna Michi, one of the stars of No No Nanette, how rehearsals were going. Oh, I think they're going very well. Uh, right at the present time, um, we're down to what I call the minute refining of a play in rehearsal. And that gets to be a little bit boring because you know 99.9% .9 of everything that you want to do uh, that is in rehearsals and this little one-tenth of one percent refinement and it, 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 the reason it gets a little boring is that you know that you still have a lot of refining to do but it's impossible to do it until you get it in front of an audience and this is why it gets to be a little tedious. What will an audience get out of No 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 No? What we hope to impart to the people that see the show is when they walk out of the theater they're on kind of cloud nine. They just are just they're euphoric, you know, they, they just, it, it's a, it, this is the kind of feeling that it's supposed to give you, and I truthfully believe this company will give that feeling. Actually, the first performance of No, 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 Ned at the Music Hall is not tomorrow night. This evening, every man and his wife who worked on the reconstruction of the hall will be the specially honored guest at a preview performance. For Channel 8 News on the Move, this is Judy Hanna.